Uh, most projects I usually have a one kind of theme album, which, which is my go-to album for that project. So I, I can hear it years later and it always brings back the idea of the work I was doing. Did you have one for this project? I did, yes. Uh, it was uh, the Pixies, Surfer Rosa, a uh, little bit old school. So, we start out by developing a free mobile app, and in the case of Erie, we use a small handheld globe. Uh, we use the app to scan the globe, and we get raw statistics on every country all over the globe. What's really great about this is it follows the three eyes. It's uh, intuitive, it's interactive, and it's intriguing. So we have different, uh, different data sets here. So we've got a rice paddy, area harvested, yield, production, seed, mm -hmm. uh, and then we've got milled rice, which is uh, your total that's used for food. Mm -hmm. So this removes everything that's for cattle feed, all that kind of thing. Then we've got consumption, calorie supply, protein supply, and fat supply. Even calorie supply. Yep. Oh. So the reason displaying in this format is uh, beneficial is because it's spatial information. Uh, so it should be displayed spatially. Uh, it makes a lot more sense when you can view uh, global trends on a globe, uh, when you can see changes over time uh, occur within the 3D space. Uh, it's much more intuitive, it's the way the human brain is designed to perceive information.